In a few weeks, it'll be exactly a year since DJI gave us the brilliant Mavic Air 2, but is there really a Mavic Air 2S on its way or not? Let's have a look. Hi, I'm Ashton Droningon, and if you want to hear the latest about new drone releases from DJI, hit that subscribe button below. Anyway, as mentioned, the Mavic Air 2 graced us with its presence almost a year ago to this month. And it's a brilliant, very capable drone, if not one of the best drones that DJI have released yet. But the rumor mill has been growing over the last few weeks with rumors of a Mavic Air 2S on its way from DJI. But what are these based on? Well, let's take a look. A label appeared on the FCC database. Now the FCC database is basically a registry of any communication type devices which emit or receive frequencies. They have to have FCC approval before they can be sold in the Americas and therefore whenever anything appears on that database we know that it's a real product. There is absolutely substance in the fact that there is a label there. However, what does the label tell us? Well, looking at it, it's exactly the same shape and size as the existing Mavic Air 2 label that's printed underneath the battery. It also shows exactly the same battery specifications as the current Mavic Air 2. On that basis, we can only assume that there's actually not gonna be a lot of difference there if this is a new product. Now, if they were to be releasing an incremental update with a better camera or more obstacle avoidance sensors or optical sensors, then you'd expect a little bit more battery capacity because ultimately, the more things that a battery here has to power, the less flight time you're going to get. So if this is actually an incremental update and it's got more features, expect potentially a shorter flight time. On the other hand, maybe they've taken the opportunity over the last 12 months to slimline and remove weight from the existing Mavic Air 2, in which case, maybe the flight time will be about the same. Besides the FCC label leak, what else do we have? Well, actually, that is it. I've even seen comments from people saying that they're not gonna buy a drone until the Air 2S is out. Well, we really don't know if and when it will or will not be released. So honestly, don't hold your breath. It could be a month, it could be six months. So if there is a Mavic Air 2S, what might it entail? What might it bring to the market that's gonna really differentiate it? Well, the last few releases from DJI have been fairly incremental and the hard hitting big major launches that we've seen over the last four or five years have slowed down dramatically. The Mavic Mini 2 brought us a better camera and an overall more capable drone, but it wasn't a radical refresh. If you already owned the Mavic Mini, then the Mini 2 wasn't much of an upgrade. However, if you didn't own the Mavic Mini, then the Mini 2 is pioneering. It was the same with the Osmo Pocket 2. It wasn't a massive radical refresh over the original Osmo Pocket. However, again, if you didn't own the Pocket 1, then the 2 is a radical, amazing product. But both of those launches were still very, very minor incremental refreshes, and that might be what we see with the Mavic Air 2S if it arrives. For that reason, if you already own the Mavic Air 2, it's highly unlikely that an incremental refresh will even be of interest to you. And if you do own that drone already, then you'll agree that it's an incredibly capable drone and that most consumers don't need Need anything better at this time. There is a rumor, and it's only a rumor, that a refreshed Air 2S might include OcuSync 3, as we've seen on the new FPV quad, which would be sorrow for me, because that would mean that my smart controller will no longer work with new DJI drones. This is a big problem with the smart controller, that its frequency chip is not replaceable, and its limitation is OcuSync 2 and no higher, because it's a hardware change, not just software. So it might be that any new drone we see coming out of DJI now won't be compatible with the smart controller, and that's an expensive device to have sat on a shelf collecting dust. If there is indeed an Air 2S, it's highly likely we'll see it in the next month because that's normally about the time period after an FCC filing appears. But remember, these are all rumors and the FCC label is all that we have right now. Comment below with what you'd like to see if there is a Mavic Air 2S. Give this video a thumbs up or a thumbs down if you're responsible for spreading fake news. And of course, hit that subscribe button. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you.